What do you guys think the path forward looks like after this meeting? Is Say again? What do, you get, what do you think the path forward looks like after this meeting with the conversation productive in there? Somewhat. Somewhat? It seemed like it was a little tense. We thought we could hear some, some Another voice wrong with tense here. conversations. Sometimes that's needed. What are the options being laid out? Uh, figure out how to work in the middle of a shutdown, see if there's a vehicle from the Senate that makes sense, uh, see if some of our colleagues who are who are known today, if there's something that they can get to that allows us to continue and proceed. What are you doing tomorrow? Is tomorrow? There, is there a plan for tomorrow yet? Back to work. Back to work. Back to work. What are you voting on? Voting on? Oh, well, what? Everybody calm down. <laughs> Appropriation bills. I mean, at the end of the day, we have a responsibility to fund this government. We're going to continue to do that work. Uh, whether the government shuts down or not, we have to continue to do that work. And you try to find a uh, resolution with the Senate, and you go from there. So, so at this point, it's, so at this point, it's appropriation bills until you can figure out a path forward on a. I mean, you tell me what else is there to do except appropriation bills? Is there, right. is there a one week or a two week bill being seriously discussed? Something shorter? Listen, the people who have to answer that question weren't even in the room right now, so I would say you pose that to them. How's that? Who's that? Sorry. I mean, come on, y'all watch the hallway like I do. You guys are smart. Well, What's wait. Up? So you. You're, you're going to consider these appropriations bills, but right. wouldn't it make more sense to keep the government open for two weeks, 30 days to consider these bills? Again, or? I had a measure on the floor today. It would have made a substantive cut to federal spending, which is needed because our inflation and our debt is a mess, and the fact that we're running a $2 trillion mm -hmm. deficit. I want to see our border secured. Our border security package was in the middle of that. Some of my colleagues voted no. That's so a question for them. That's so not a question for me. So shutdown is inevitable at this point. Well, that's a question for them at that point. It's not a so question for me. This is a CR again. Can you try another one, or is that dead in the water at this point? The people who need to answer that question, are the people who voted no on the floor today. Are you concerned about some of the centrists who might try to advance a CR that doesn't include the conservative policies you put in your bill? Right yeah, now? I'm very concerned about that um, because it's going to put us. And frankly, let us forget that. It's going to put the American people in a really bad spot because if the Senate has way more leverage in this battle over spending, what we're going to see is no change in federal spending, no change in border policy, no change in the weaponization in our government, and the people are going to go back home, and how are they going to face the voters that sent them here? I'm very concerned about it, that. I think my colleagues uh, need, to be, need to be mindful of that. Do you have a sense of what's happening tomorrow? Is there um, another vote to try to head off the shutdown? That's, I would say that's a question for the leadership. Something tells me they're going to be out soon. What do you think, what do you think should happen tomorrow? I think tomorrow, whether we're voting on the floor or not, we need to be worrying about the energy and water bill, the transportation and uh, HUD bill, and every other bill that we need to pass. By the way, I would also say, what's the Senate doing right now? Because we have passed four appropriation bills here in the House. They've not passed one. Somebody should ask Chuck Schumer if he's serious about actually keeping our government open as well. And I will reiterate, as far as I'm concerned and a lot of my colleagues, our border needs to be secured. Regardless if it's a CR or total appropriation bills, this government's borders, the government has to do its job and secure the nation's borders. See you guys. Have fun. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir.